52 meters. So that is our answer. So remember, when we're finding the perimeter of a rectangle, we're finding the length around the outside. Because these are the same, we take one of them, multiply it by two. Because these are the same, we take one of them and multiply it by two. Then we add them together. Write down your formula every time because that is your steps to get you through the problem. And I want you to remember that. So each time you work a perimeter problem, write down your formula. Oops, I dropped my marker lid. You have two story problems to use this in today, and then they give you shapes in which you are finding the perimeter. Now remember, your formula is only for rectangles. If you're not finding the perimeter of a rectangle, then don't use the formula for the perimeter of a rectangle. Um, for example, in number two, they give you a triangle. So the perimeter there is just the length around the outside. So you just add them all together. Work carefully through your lesson. Let me know if you have any questions and I will see you in language class.